So hello there and welcome to the tutorial. My name is Shannon Bakshi and this time we're going to be going over a first in a new series called Outdoor Science Experiments with Tanmay. Uh, and so this time we're going to be going over a pretty simple experiment. Uh, this is uh, just, I have a little uh, jug here, uh, I have a little pipe, I've cut a hole through its cap. Uh, I've put the pipe through as you can see uh, and I've filled it in so it's completely airtight, or almost completely. Now, apart from that, uh, uh, I'm, I bef just before we start, I have to explain a little bit of vocabulary to you. Uh, so beginning, uh, we have, first of all, what is a fluid? A uh, fluid, uh, as you might know, is a liquid. However, uh, not like you know, or maybe you don't, maybe you do, uh, air or uh, gas is also a fluid. Anything that is not a solid would be considered a fluid. Uh, so air is a fluid, uh, water is a fluid, uh, any soda would be a fluid, etc, uh, etc. Et you get the point. Uh, anyway, continuing uh, now, uh, I'm going to start the experiment. And so what I'm going to do uh, is I'm going to take this pipe, as you can see it's connected in, and it's going into the water. I'm going to blow into this, and something will happen after I blow. And let's just see exactly what happens. And then I'll explain exactly how it happens. Well, we need a little bit more pressure. As you can see, the water essentially just shoots right out of the um, jug. Uh, and so, right out of the jug, it just starts flowing right out. Now, how this works is, as you know, uh, air would be considered a fluid. So when I'm putting more air into this, what's happening uh, is that, first of all, you know that this has a constant amount of volume. It's not going to change. It's not going to be less volume or more volume. Uh, so what will happen uh, is when I blow more in, that means there's more molecules inside of this container than its volume can hold. Uh, and so what will happen, in turn, is it will want to it has a more pressure uh, inside of this uh, inside of this jug than outside. So what's going to happen is it wants to even out with the pressure outside. So it, it as in turn will find the clearest route to empty some of its mass outside. Uh, so what it's going to do uh, is it's pretty much done. Uh, just do this. Uh, and so uh, what I'm going to do actually I have a pretty good idea. Yeah, okay, uh, so uh, what it's going to do uh, is it's going to, as you can see, the pipe is connected to the water, so it's going to take its water and it's going to push it over uh, from the pipe uh, and it'll, all the water or some water will actually go out of the pipe. Uh, and so that's how that works. Uh, and so, just to give you a clear demonstration, now that you know how it works, if I blow into this, there is more pressure uh, and due to the fact that there is more pressure uh, inside of here, it'll want to even out with the pressure over here. Uh, and so what'll happen uh, is it will uh, just basically eject water out of itself because that pipe is connected to the water. And then once it's evened out uh, the pressure, uh, it will easily be able to stop. Uh, so now, right as this stops, which is just about, I might just speed up this clip now, maybe. When I'm editing this video, I might. Sorry, it's taking this long. Yeah, see, so I just put in a bit extra air, uh, and it's just gonna pump out all this water until it is able to, st uh, until all the pressure is evened out. So again, uh, f uh, air is actually compressible, uh, just like a, a fluid. So basically, fluids are anything that can be compressed uh, and stuff like that. Okay. So it's pretty much done now. All right, there's, there's a few last drops come out. Uh, again, since this is pressure, uh, what you can do uh, is technically you should just be able to open this cap, which I don't want to do right now, uh, and all the pressure will leave. Uh, and as you can see, it's done. Uh, so uh, now that you know how it works, uh, I can do this once more. And as you can see, pretty satisfying. 
to see this happen. Uh, and it's amazing, Al although there isn't enough food color for it to be a red water stream, uh, it's good enough. And so, as you can see, it's just gonna keep going and going now. Uh, because if you can, if you were here and actually pressing this jug, as you can see, you can't really press this even though it's just plastic. Uh, because there's so much pressure, uh, all this air wants to leave. But since there's no, the pipe, there's no way for air to get out. There's only way for water to get out, which is through the pipe. So it's going to shoot whatever it can out the pipe. Uh, it, and so if I were to put this pipe on the air, it would actually just shoot out the air uh, instead of, uh, sorry, sorry. It would actually shoot out the air uh, instead of shooting out uh, the water. But again, there's no fun in that, so that's why we're not going to be doing that. As you can see, it's just going to do that for a while. And... And soon it should be done. Yeah. That was pretty much it, and... Yeah, that was it. While this uh, is finishing up its pressure, essentially, I'm just going to give my outro. So that was pretty much it for this video. Uh, if you like my video, if you like my content and you want to see more of it, uh, please consider subscribing to my channel. Uh, and also, if you like my video, you can consider liking the video as well. If you have any questions about how this works or anything else, you can always comment down below. You can even email me at tajiman.gmail.com. My email will be down in the description if you couldn't understand that. And that's going to be it. Goodbye.